Today we're doing Lesson 16 from the workbook of A Course in Miracles. Lesson 16. I have no neutral thoughts. I have no neutral thoughts. The idea for today is a beginning step in dispelling the belief that your thoughts have no effect. Everything you see is the result of your thoughts. There is no exception to this fact. Thoughts are not big or little or powerful or weak. They are merely true or false. Those that are true create their own likeness. Those that are false make theirs. There is no more self-contradictory concept than that of idle thoughts. <laughs> What gives rise to the perception of a whole world can hardly be called idle. Every thought you have contributes to truth or to illusion. Either it extends the truth or it multiplies illusions. You can indeed multiply nothing, but you will not extend it by doing so. Besides your recognizing that thoughts are never idle, salvation requires that you also recognize that every thought you have brings either peace or war, either love or fear. A neutral result is impossible because a neutral thought is impossible. There is such a temptation to dismiss fear thoughts as unimportant, trivial, and not worth bothering about that it is essential you recognize them all as equally destructive but equally unreal. We will practice this idea in many forms before you really understand it. In applying the idea for today, search your mind for a minute or so with eyes closed and actively seek not to overlook any little thought that may tend to elude the search. This is quite difficult until you get used to it. You will find that it is still hard for you not to make artificial distinctions. Every thought that occurs to you, regardless of the qualities that you assign to it, is a suitable subject for applying today's idea. In the practice periods, first repeat the idea to yourself, and then, as each one crosses your mind, hold it in awareness while you tell yourself. This thought about blank is not a neutral thought. That thought about blank is not a neutral thought. As usual, use today's idea whenever you are aware of a particular thought that arouses uneasiness. The following form is suggested for this purpose. This thought about blank is not a neutral thought because I have no neutral thoughts. <clears throat> Four to five practice periods are recommended if you find them relatively effortless. If strain is experienced, three will be enough. The length of the exercise period should also be reduced if there is discomfort. Lesson 16. I have no neutral thoughts. If you'd like to read my commentary on the workbook, go to amytorresasim.com and click on Amy's blog. Namaste.